Hey guys, what's up? Uh, we're back. We're going to talk a uh, little bit of uh, week four, or week three, uh, play some games. Week four, sorry. And it was the uh, Atlanta Falcons against the Carolina Panthers in Carolina. Um, rival game, obviously. And um, Atlanta went down and uh, lost. Uh, 9 to 24. Only could manage a couple field goals. Jason Neelum, three for three though. He uh, had He's a good done pretty well. He had a lot of opportunities. Not that um, Matt Ryan hasn't played. He's played well. What do you think about uh, the way he's progressing as NFL quarterback? I think he's going pretty quick. He's uh, progressing very quick. He's still he's got a lot of stuff to learn, obviously, but. Uh, I'm seeing some good shine, signs from him in uh, a couple of years. There's no doubt he's going to be a, one of the top-notch quarterbacks unless something happens to him, like an injury or who knows what could happen. But you, know, you never know. Like Vic, you never knew that was coming. But <laughs> something could happen. You never know. But he, right now he's looking good. He's throwing two touchdowns, two interceptions. But uh, I think he's, uh, he's looking good. He's hitting all the all the nice passes. But he needs some good, better uh, receivers. Yeah, um, um, uh, just not cutting. Kind of, White's White's the only. Uh, yeah, one outside of him, I don't know really. who I'll say has it's really. I mean, Jenkins is all right. Kind of a bust because he was. A, I think he was a first round pick. Was kind of waste and. Um, Robinson's hurt. Yeah, Robinson. Uh, hopefully, he can break out. I think he could be a good. Uh, he could be a good slot guy. I think. Yeah, I think they need the other receiver. Maybe another like Douglas. Number one. Douglas is another guy who's like slot at best, basically. Yeah. But uh, he's got the speed. They all, we have quick, quick receivers, basically, but the hands aren't really the best. Roddy White's been still doing good, though, I think. He's coming into a number one receiver. And I think we're looking good down, down the stretch, maybe next year, year after that. Some people are saying we could uh, get into the playoffs in a couple of years. You never know. But this week, we are going to Green Bay, which is, again, not an easy task against their defense. But they have um, been plagued with a lot of injuries. Yeah, um... Al Harris out for a couple of weeks. Uh, Colin, Jen Colin Jenkins was just uh, just said he's out for the season. And then Aaron Rodgers, they see, was sure. limited in practice with the shoulder. So who he may not play. So, so Matt Flynn will go if he doesn't. They said so. Um, so we 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 have a chance now because the best players are hurt except for like Driver, but and their running game hasn't really started at all no, yet. Grant hasn't yep. done anything this year. He's kind of been a bust. Um, I think even Charles Woodson was hurt a little bit and he got dinged up in the game. And I think Nick Collins or safety was too, but uh, they'll probably get in the game some somehow. But either way, I think we're looking good for the game. But you never know. Matt Ryan's still young. It's still a, a veteran defense unless uh, again those people don't play. And, uh, and it's going to be tough for us because it's in Green Bay and uh, Lambeau Field's a tough place to win at. Yeah, You definitely. never know. If they got the rookie quarterback going with Flynn, it's it's going to be a lot easier for Ryan, even though he's a rookie too, but obviously he's better. He's, yeah, he's had more experience. I think Flynn was in the game a little bit last week, but not too much. I mean, Ryan's got uh, four starts under his belt. He's got two wins under his belt, which is huge. All at home now. Touchdowns. Yeah. Haven't well, won on the road yet. 0-2, obviously, on the road. But they're looking to get, they said they're looking to get their first win uh, on the road. It's and it's possible. I think it is possible. Yeah, I think it is possible. Um, got to get turned of the ball. I uh, think if the Packers are a healthy team, you'd say it'd probably yeah. be a long shot because you know Falcons are you know a lot of young guys and yeah. not too much experience. But now with R maybe Rodgers not playing, and you know their defense is definitely going to be um, not as good. So I think Roddy White could have a breakout game. Um, Michael Turner, hopefully Definitely. he can be good for them. Uh, they've been running the ball a lot. Matt Ryan's only been passing for like like 150 yards each yeah. time, which is good because they can get Turner more involved than Norwood and get the running game. Um, Turner's leading. Open up the he's pass. got the most rushing yards of anyone yeah, so far. Yeah, he's done great. So. Um, whoever has him in fantasy, I'm sure is uh, <laughs> happy. I hope they can just continue point. to do this, and uh, we'll definitely get win if we can obviously get the ball like 20 times, get over 100 some yards, and a couple touchdowns. Just take the pressure off of Matt Ryan, like he's been doing the first couple of games. Yeah, just definitely. continue to do that. I think we definitely got a big shot. So, who knows what's going to happen week five? Uh, we're looking forward to it in a couple of days. Uh, we're back with more videos. Go Falcons!